Craig, a cracking match today, with perhaps chances to win it? Yeah, I thought the longer the game went on, the more we was likely to win it. I thought they were a better side in the first half, but I thought we had the better chances. And um, yeah, it was a tight game and um, overall, I'm not too disappointed with, it, with the result because I thought we played well and um, like I say, I thought we, we could have nixed it at the end. A debut from Lyon. Yeah. A goal from your new striker, Tommy. You must be pleased with them coming into the side. Yeah, really pleased. You know, <clears throat> to be fair, we only signed Lyon on the, on the back of the game at Bucker still. He did well. Um, <clears throat> obviously, with, with Sam and Vember out as well, we were, we're, we're light in that position. So, <clears throat> Um, we changed the shape round a little. Um, had a debut for him, and I thought he'd done ever so well first first game up. And uh, Tommy, <clears throat> delighted. I mean, that was a big signing for us in in, in the summer. Um, unfortunately, he picked up an injury in the first game, but <clears throat> I thought he was superb today, and he'll just get better and better. And getting capping it with a goal was 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 really good for us <clears throat> and him. I had a chat with the fans after the match. Yeah. They made Lorden man of the match for the newspaper, but there were a few contenders from both sides. What were your thoughts? <clears throat> yeah, Lorden, I mean, I thought he was terrific, you know, but um, I have to be very careful awarding Lorden ever a man of the match because he's always looking for more money. So, <laughs> but uh, <clears throat> no, he played very well, you know, and uh, I thought that the shape that we, we, we played suited him, and uh, no, he was, he was very good. <clears throat> Hendon on Monday, um, 3G, Silver Jubilee Park. It's been a while since we've been over there. You looking forward to uh, that one? Yeah, very much so. You know, it's good, <clears throat> like, like for everyone, the early stages of the season, the two games in three days is, 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 is tough on them. But, you know, it's the same for both sides and we've got a fit side, so. And uh, the, the squad and <clears throat> hopefully we're having Sammy Beck available, so yeah, it was. Uh, it's, it's looking good. That was going to be my next question. How's the squad looking for the second part of the bank holiday <coughs> weekend? Um, well, like I say, Tam, Sammy, I think is is fifty fifty. Be great to get him back. Um, <clears throat> but we made a a, a major sign in today, and I'm I'm really really pleased. Top top lad. Um, <clears throat> uh, unfortunately, he's not had a very successful career. He's uh, last three years. He's only Won the Ishmael Prem, played at Wembley in the FA Trophy, winning, and played in the FA Vars, Vars at Wembley, winning. Uh, it's Remy Sutton, and uh, top lad, really delighted to get him. And uh, he's a serial winner, he's a serial winner, and um, he just made the squad group uh, stronger. And he's, um, you know, he's a leader. He's he's, he's just he's just going to be such a good player. He was always rated. Yeah, yeah. You know, I've always been a big fan of his, and to you know to get that was I think it's massive for the club. You know, so looking. For, unfortunately, <clears throat> with the uh, um, bless him, the rules of the league and the FA, um, he's not eligible for Monday because you have to be signed by five o'clock on Friday in the bank holiday. But um, he'll be in, involved in the, in the squad for next next week in the FA Cup, which incidentally, obviously we know we've got nine days notice that we have to play that on a Sunday, so the same rules don't apply. And uh, <clears throat> it is disappointing because we've got boys that had work lined up and um, and obviously family things, they build everything around the Saturday. You know, we're, we're, we're semi-pro footballers, we're not pro footballers, so it's disappointing that we we were forced to play that on a Sunday, but it is what it is. We've got our heads around it now, and we'll we'll go up there, and I'm sure we'll speak about it in the week. We'll go up there with uh, uh, full intentions of getting in the next round. I'm looking forward to it, Craig, and I'm looking forward to Monday as well. Thank you very much.